something here show us and they kept one of my friends kept messing with that and he kept saying it and saying it louder and louder and I was standing in the doorway of the lobby that's right here and out of an instance it felt like cold and dark students before us even have said that when their laundry is down there sometimes it'll just be folded when they come back I don't know if that's like a good steward or someone who just folds laundry all the time but it's happened and they said she like fell down the stairs or something and it got darker and the lights were on behind me and if like I was standing in the door facing him, he was facing the museum room and there was one of my other friends standing right in front of me and she turned pale to the face because <clears throat> at the time she didn't know what it was but like later she told me that behind me it started getting dark, like the lights were dimming and it got cold and, I, and it, it was kind of scary so I decided to like turn and it looked like a sh like just shadow just walking into the pool room. There is this teddy bear who sat on that chair and every time someone would come down here the teddy bear would move and like be in a different place. And it was probably someone playing a joke but it was always kind of funny to see when the bear would be next. And then one time I came down here and it was sitting on one of the pipes and it made a shadow behind it of just like a giant like bear monster uh, thing. Uh, it was terrifying. But then someone took it so it's gone forever now. The floors creak a lot so when you're walking around all you just hear is like creaking just gotta get used to it because it's just the old building. Alright, so that was our tour of Rhodes Garrett Hamiel, and I hope that you are ready for next week's video where we take on Goddard Hall. The